In this video, we'll cover the Blockstream Jade Plus, a powerful hardware wallet designed for ultimate Bitcoin security. The Jade Plus excels with its air-gapped capabilities, meaning it uses its built-in camera to scan and display QR codes for all transactions, keeping your private keys completely offline and isolated from your computer or phone. In this video, I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process, setting it up in a QR mode and connecting it to your bull wallet. So let's open up the box and see what's inside. We straight away are greeted with the beautiful Jade Plus. There's a nice message on the inside of the box that says, simple enough for beginners, advanced enough for cypherpunks. I love that message. Reminds me of exactly what we're doing with a bull wallet. We can take this out. We can see there is a setup guide, instruction leaflet inside. We have, which is super important, the recovery sheets, so the 12 seed words that you need to back up and keep safe in case you lose your Jade device so that you can always recover your Bitcoin. You get the compact seed QR as well, which you can create based off the 12 seed words. And you also have the 24 word version recovery sheet and 24 word compact seed QR. So we'll put these to the side for now and return back to the actual main device. So I pull it out. Here is the Jade Plus. As you can see, it's had a big upgrade from the first generation Jade. It comes in a full body metal. It has a new upgraded better camera and it has a few extra buttons. So at the bottom we have the power button. We have on the main screen, the select button. And then on the top, we have two toggles to move left or right. Now let's go ahead and power up the device. So we'll hold the power button at the bottom for a few seconds and the Jade Plus comes to life. So now that we have the Jade Plus powered on, we'll follow the on-screen instructions. We'll select Setup Jade, we'll click Continue, and we're presented with two setup types. We have the basic setup and we have the advanced setup. The difference is the begin setup is if you wanna set up your Jade Plus using the USB cable via the proprietary Blockstream wallet app, or if you want to do like in our case, the QR mode, which is the air gap version, you need to scroll down and select advanced setup. We select continue. Now you have an option to create a new wallet or restore a wallet. In this instance, we'll be creating a new wallet. We can choose 12 or 24 words. It's up to you which one you want to choose, but I usually go with the 12 word option. And it says these words are your wallet, keep them protected and offline. We click continue and we're presented with the first batch of four words. Now, remember in the beginning, I mentioned you have the recovery sheet. You can write those down here. My example, I have an extra sheet where I will write down these seed words. To get to the next batch, you just click the on-screen button and you get the next set of words. Now that we have written down our 12 seed words, the next option will be to test them. So we select next again, and you'll have to confirm the exact words that you've written down. So in this instance, it's asking to confirm word number three, which was Jim. So we select Jim. Word number four. And then we have, after we confirmed the seed words, It'll ask us if we wanna export the recover seed phrase as compact QR, which I showed you, you get a card where you can dot down the initial lines to create a seed QR backup. But in this case, we will skip it. And you see the three connection options. You have USB, Bluetooth, or QR. So we'll go down and select QR. Now next is where you need to open up your laptop and visit blkstream.com forward slash pn. So once you're on the Blockstream website link shown on your device, we'll go ahead and select continue. It'll prompt you to create a new pin and we'll confirm the pin once again. And then you will be presented with your first QR code, which you need to scan with your computer. Going back to the computer, we'll click done open up your camera and you wanna scan this QR code on your device. Once your computer has scanned the QR code, we will 
tap the tick button, essentially just the front facing camera on your Jade Plus. And we'll scan now the QR code, which is presented on your computer screen. And there you have it. Your Jade Plus has now been initiated. As you can see in the left bottom corner, it says active. You can see your wallet fingerprint in the right bottom corner. The initial setup step has been completed. Now that we have successfully set up our Blockstream Jade, the next thing is to connect it to our bull wallet. So to do that, you simply have to scroll to options and scroll one down to wallet, select export XPUB, and you'll be presented with your wallet XPUB QR code. We then on our bull wallet, go over in the right hand corner to settings, Bitcoin settings, import wallet and select Blockstream Jade. Tap on open the camera. We scan the QR code on the Blockstream Jade. We give it a label and tap import. And there we have it. The Blockstream Jade has now been paired with your Bull Wallet app. To receive Bitcoin directly to your Blockstream Jade using the Bull Wallet, you simply tap the Jade Wallet, which we just imported, tap the receive button, and you'll be presented with a fresh new Bitcoin address as well as the QR code of the address. So you can share that with someone that wants to send you funds or if you wanna send it yourself, you can just scan this QR code, send the sats and they will land in your Blockstream Jade wallet. And finally, let's look at how to send Bitcoin from your Blockstream Jade using your bull wallet. The first thing you'll wanna do is power up your device. So with the button at the bottom. And don't tap Unlock Jade, scroll to the next option, QR mode. Tap the select button, choose QR pin and lock, which is what we set up in the previous step. Or you can scan the seed QR if you inputted the seed QR when we were creating a new wallet. In this instance, we will select QR pin unlock. It once again guides us to the blockstream.com forward slash PN website. So have that loaded on your computer and select continue. You'll be prompted to enter your Jade pin. And we're presented once again with a new QR code. Now we go over to the computer. We load the same website as in the initial setup stage. We scan the QR code on our Jade Plus. We tap select on the Jade and we scan the QR code on our computer screen. Now that we're unlocked and logged into our Jade Plus, we'll return back to the Bull Wallet app. So to send, we will tap the Jade Wallet, click send and open the camera. We will enable a new address on a different wallet, scan it with our camera. We can input the amount of sats that we want to send. In this instance, we'll send 50,000 sats. Click continue, and you will need to tap show PSBT. Now this QR code needs to be scanned with your Jade Plus device. So you tap to the right and select scan QR. You will then scan the QR code on your Bull Wallet device. You will then see the address of where you're sending to. So you can verify that it's the correct address. Select next. We will see the fee rate. And now we need to scan this QR code with our Bull Wallet device. So we click on done camera and we tap broadcast and there we have it your transaction has successfully been broadcasted and as you can see the balance has been now reduced and the 50,000 bitcoin has been received in the other wallet so to summarize this video the jake plus in qr mode provides enhanced security by keeping your private keys offline for both receiving and sending transactions. One less important thing that I want to mention is to make sure that you keep your firmware always up to date on your Jade Plus. And if you want to do so, you can also 
get the addition of the Jade link, which allows you to update your firmware on Jade Plus in an air-gapped fashion. You simply plug in the Jade link into your computer, download the latest firmware, plug it into your Jade and update the firmware so that your device never ever touches a computer or a mobile phone.